I believe all children who come here should have the best experience. We're here to put children first, which we do. The school is very friendly and the staff is so good. The atmosphere in our school is, is a warm atmosphere, it's a positive atmosphere. It's an atmosphere of high expectations of our team, it's high expectations of our children. We are here to support them, but we're also here to make sure that every part of their day is filled with learning, with play, with communication with others. They helped him in his uh, language. Language. They give him confidence to speak, to talk, to be socialised with other kids. We're a small team with a shared vision where the success of the children is at the heart of everything that we do. They're completely aware of where each child is in terms of like development and the, and the points of improvement that he needs to make. I feel that my kid is treated as an individual. That's why he wakes up in the morning with a big smile on his face and looks forward to coming to school. The inquiry curriculum comes from a vision of children owning their own learning. They become the questioners, they become the inquisitors, um, and as teachers we become the, the facilitators of the learning. We're looking for them to be engaged, to be inspired. We want to um, really ignite their curiosity about the world. The school is the best, the teachers are cool. They make it fun. Yeah, they make it fun. In phonics we learn all the letters and digraphs and then year one we're gonna learn split digraphs. It's definitely really important for us to follow the children's interests so when we know that they are really interested in the small world and creating imaginative stories we want to be able to build something that reflects that so they can take that further. We're growing beans! The plants need water and sunlight to grow into beans. We also like tidying up. We also recognise things in which they might need to work on themselves, whether that's gross motor or fine motor skills, being able to find an activity that promotes that and helps them and really gets them working at it. 11 before 11 is one of the most exciting things I personally believe about being in a Reach 2 school. It's the promise we make to the children to have 11 wonderful experiences during their journey with us. And we use it, we tie it into the curriculum. For example, sleeping under the stars when you're exploring space. Um, it could be when we're doing in our geography areas, crossing borders. So we tie it in and it becomes something that the children in the school are really aware that it's something special happening. What's really, really essential to me that children exit our school with academic ability but they also have a strong self-esteem because I think self-esteem um, is essential to being great citizens within our community. We want them to be fully rounded individuals. We, we talk a lot about being respectful, so how we are with each other and how we are to other people. I definitely want them to be independent, resilient and just proud of who they are and what they can achieve. It's very uh, nice to see the difference between when the he starts until now from education, personality, confidence and how he talks. Uh, I'm very proud of him actually and proud of the school. My son feels supported, nurtured and safe. Therefore he is beaming with smile and uh, looking forward to his day at school and growing confident. Every day I look forward forward to what the teacher will tell me about my kids, what did they do today. So I, I really like that and we're looking forward to continue the journey here.